Hello everybody, welcome back to another video. So, this might look a little weird to you. So in this video, we will actually be playing one of my favorite games. It's a VR game called Rec Room. So, we're going to be trying out some quests. If you don't know what Rec Room is, it's kind of like Roblox, but for VR. And it's a lot better, in my opinion. So, yeah, let's just hop right into it. So... What do we want to pick? What quest should we do first? How about Golden Trophy? Let's jump right into it. All right, let's get some goblins. I'm gonna get these because nobody else is. Don't- oh, there was- oh, sorry. I'll let the other dudes get them. You can get them. Ugh. Whoa. That was... weird. Just legged quite bad. Ah. Oh. The person left. That sucks. Hello? <laughs> that was interesting. All right. Why didn't I move? Ugh. That was not a smart move. Oh. You are fooling around. I know that you can double bow. I'm just... Well, not double bow. Um... Double shoot or whatever. Yeah, they just did it. Oh, sorry. Didn't mean to do that. But I'm not very good at it. Alright, um, let's go. Alright, so if you somehow don't know what's happening already. Out! I do that all the time with those. I just forget to move. Alright. As I was saying, so if you don't know what's happening, we're doing a rec room quest, and there's five different quests in this game. Right now, we're playing Golden Trophy, and I'm gonna play every quest in the game, and there's, like, those are official quests, and some people make their own, which we might, I might try out sometime, because... That might be fun. But, um, we might do the Rise of Jumbotron for the next one. That works too. <laughs> which is the, this one, which is a golden trophy, and then the Rise of Jumbotron. They're my two favorite ones in this game. I just find they're the easiest, even though some people think that Jumbotron... Oh. Some people think that Jumbotron's one of the hardest, but I don't know if it's just because I've played it so much, but I find Jumbotron pretty easy. I mean, I can't do it solo or anything. I can't do any quest solo. Because I'm not that good at this game. <laughs> Alright. I was gonna wait for a goblin, because there's a large one that spawns right here, but... I'll get it later, because if you're good at this game, unlike me, um, you can- yeah, there it is. Before it even touches the ground. Oh, hi. Some people are able to get it before it even spawns. 
I can't do yet, but I have played with some people who can. Oh, that was close. And it's quite impressive, honestly. And, oh, sorry. <laughs> and it's quite impressive that people can beat quests faster than I can with the team while doing it solo. It's pretty crazy. I mean, I guess it's mainly just practice. Because practice makes Parmesan cheese. Um, I don't know why. I don't know what you're saying, but I'm going this way. Hey. In case you didn't know, which you probably didn't, these red ones, they're elites, they're called. They're way stronger than the green ones. And then Jumbotron is purple elite ones. Which, if you don't know, the Rise of Jumbotron is a robot one. This is goblins. This is the easiest quest in the game. I'd say, most people agree, the hardest is Isle of Lost Skulls, Crescendo, and Crimson Cauldron, which... Crescendo isn't super hard, it's just a very long quest. Like, the first time I beat it, it took me almost 40 minutes to beat it, which is quite a while. But, um, I've been it in 20 minutes, I think think before. I've been it three times. Yeah, three, two or three times. Can't remember. My profile picture on Rec Room is actually me at the end of Crescendo because I was finally beat it because I was trying so hard to beat it and I finally got it and I was just really happy that I got it. Oh, that's like the worst score I've ever gotten. This person seems pretty good. Oh, this is the worst level ever. Like, ever. If you have a bad team, you don't want to do this level. This is, I'd say this is the hardest level in the game. Because it's just, I don't know, something about it. A lot of people agree with me. This is the hardest level in Golden Trophy. I don't fully know what it is. Might be just that it's a decently small area, or I'm not fully sure. It's just hard. We only have two more levels, I think, actually, surprisingly. We've done this quite fast. Two more levels and then the boss battle. And yeah, this guy. I used to find these guys were really hard, but they're not that hard, the big guys. I mean, they're not like easy. Oh, what? He just, like, became a Beyblade and just sawed me in half. I do not appreciate it. Oh. Okay, I'm just gonna get you. Thank you. Cool, I'll take it. I'll throw it on my back. That did not go how I was wanting it to, but same as that, but it still worked. Oh, your shield. Oh, you lost your shield. There's some on this level, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, there's some on this level. I don't know if you guys have noticed, but there's shields that hang on walls. Swords and shields as decoration. Well, I don't know if it's fully just decoration. I think it's just in case you lose your shield or something. I've done it before. Oh, sound like there's someone over there. Guess not. Hey! Out! Why didn't I go for... Sorry, Adam, whoever you are. Why did I just get two? Okay. Uh, 
take it. Out. Oh, I forgot. It's not when they're down. It's after they've like been destroyed. They don't do the fireballs. If you got hit, it doesn't do damage, which is nice. But I forgot that it's not just when they're knocked down. It's after they have completely just quit. <laughs> oh yeah, there's shield here. Oh, is the dude double shielding? I mean double sorting? Nope. Oh my. My aim with bows is terrible. I just find bows a lot of fun. Oh, I'm lagging horribly. Ow, ah! took way longer than it needed. This level isn't the easiest. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna use the classic sword for this, because I'm much better with swords. This is the last level. And then there's the boss fight. Out! Oh, wait, what? Um, didn't know you were there. Hi! Watch out! He's playing ping pong with its body. And Out! Banana swords. Whoa, I am lagging. You have to drop your stuff. Oh. Wow, impressive. I think we have one more wave after these dudes. Then we beat the level. Hello? Oh, hi. I knew there was someone in there. Not a big dude. I mean, those definitely aren't the biggest dudes in this game. Ah, ah. Oh, Adam. Adam, Adam, Adam. Alright, oh, Adam. Ooh. Ooh. Out. Oh. I'm lagging bad, and I'm just bad in general. It's not a good combo. Whoa. Um. Oh. Oh, what? Where's my bow? Guess I'm getting a new bow. This bow's is fine. I don't really mind. Uh. platform. This is the boss battle, in case you couldn't tell. This is boss man. He's not the boss. He's very annoying. I mean, he is the boss. Just an annoying boss. I mean, if you're using glitches, well, they're not really glitches, but certain techniques, this boss is extremely easy but when you're not it 
is not the easiest of things. Ooh, you good? There, there. Ow! Ah, I got some damage done, I think. I can't see it's- oh, yeah. I actually, I don't know if I did anything. kind of cool is if you look up there that's the golden trophy it's oh we did it that's why this quest is called oh um seriously i just beat the boss my dorm room reset and the game crashes before I got my reward. Ah! <sighs> Whatever. Guess I'm gonna have to beat him again.